A big change is on its way to a small Utah town. Tonight, the Uinta City Council passed a measure to dissolve its fire department and to be added to the Weber Fire District. News specialist Matt Roscone is live in Uinta with more on what led up to tonight's vote. Matt? Yeah, guys, volunteer firefighters here have been serving the small town of Uinta for decades. But there are some concerns over costs and staffing. And now it seems it's on its way out. I just hope it doesn't end. It's the beginning of the end for the Uinta Fire Department. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carries. A big part of the small town of Uinta for nearly 50 years. I just hope that Uinta City keeps their own. Mark Sacco is the current fire marshal. Tensions have been a little bit high on both sides, uh, but we're both trying to press forward and, and try to do what's right. The former fire chief the, moved away recently, sparking a debate over whether it's finally time to move away from their volunteer crew. Our time spent on, on calls is completely volunteer and we love that. There are a lot of folks that uh, are very emotional about it. Right now, out of just 12 firefighters, only one lives in Uinta. But on the other hand, we're not finding a lot of folks that are stepping up and saying, okay, I'll volunteer. Tonight, the city mayor and council members said COVID had made it difficult for them to gather more input from their town of just 1,300. I just hope that the uh, the voice of the community has been heard by the council. City leaders praised the current firefighters, but ultimately voted against the department and to be annexed into the Weber Fire District. Now, a quick look up on Google actually shows the department is permanently closed. The mayor did say if there is enough opposition in the town, they, it could end up on the ballot for voters to decide. Matt Rascone, KSL 5 News.